And now what I'm gonna do is I'm, I'm gonna leave it kind of flat. So circle, circle for the highlight, and I'm gonna fill in the rest of this. Like so. And let's go over here and draw the tail, okay? Online Cur shopping. Whoops. And curve for that tail. Line right there. Line right here for the color change. And we can have the other paw come in here. The color change there. And there is a color change on the back paw, but let's draw two lines right there to separate those out. All right. And another line down here for Buzz's shoulders. It's going to make it look more mechanical, right? More gears and stuff like that. Uh, now, the last thing is I'm going to draw a little bit of a thick line on the outside of stuff, outside of this whole thing. Just a little bit of a thicker line, nothing too wild. I just think a thicker line kind of brings it together. Don't forget to share the video, by the way. Um, if you share the video, I will notice. Um, and sharing the video is what helps the channel out the most. So I, I appreciate it. Thank you so much if you are willing to do that. Curl over here, curl over here. Line up over here. Just continuing, just the, like imagine like, it's just the outer, the complete outer edge of everything. It just kind of brings it together and it's good line art. Um, this is what people do in comics. So I kind of, you know, like that. Out over here, down. Over here, down. Line over here. Line over here. Right on. And you can always throw a few more details in here with thin lines. Remember, thin lines. Maybe like edge of his nose there. Lower part of his mouth thin. Keep the lines thin, you know? Um, maybe give him eyelids. Very, very thin. And all these lines, oh, that's too thick. But all these lines are meant to kind of bring about, um, just kind of, just kind of bring about um, more detail. It makes it look like you paid attention a lot more, which hopefully you did, and just started kind of doing that, like things with edges, right? Thin line of this button, right? Maybe something in there. But yeah, I want to thank you very much. You guys are amazing. Don't forget, always keep drawing, and uh, you guys can always show me if you want. I can put my email out there. Go to the website. The main website is sketchingeasy.com, and I'll see you next time. Okay, let's go over how to draw buzz and socks, okay? So, I'm gonna start with the top of Buzz's head, because he's gonna be sitting on top of his head, so I'm gonna draw a curve here. And I'm gonna go down. Over here on this side. Down. Out down in kind of for those uh, thing covering his ear and out down in for the kind of cloth covering his ear down here down here <laughs> good 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 so far I'm gonna go over here and find the eye curve over here on one side Curve here on the other. Line underneath. Line underneath. Okay. Sweet, sweet. Gonna go right here and go into the eyes, and it's gonna curve right here, curve right here, kind of looking up at the cat, at socks, the cat. 
the line right here, line right here for the pupils inside the iris. And you could leave a little bit in there for a highlight. line over here for the eyebrow it's gonna be making that like kind of confused face or one eyebrow is like that like a u-shape and the other one is up <coughs> all right on I'm gonna go over here and I'm going to draw his nose up just a very very simple like that very simplistic and before I do anything else, I'm going to go in and draw the cloth, you know, changing uh, the border around his face. Curve around here. That one's going to hit the side there. Line over here. Down over here. In. <coughs> Line over here, inward, and he's got this big chin, so we're going to leave that chin there, all big like that. <coughs> going to go over here to the mouth, line over here, it's very like perplexed, like what's this, and a butt chin he has, he's a large chin. Right on. Maybe a little line here at the edges of the mouth. All right. Maybe a little line right here underneath the eye, just a bit. And then possibly we're going to give him a nostril here on one side. And maybe curve for a little bit of the wing of the nostril. Right on. So let's go over here to... We're going to find the large curve of kind of his suit line over here line over here <laughs> out over here curve <coughs> line on this side kind of just to shorten a shorthand the gear right that he has down. By the way, if you like the Buzz Lightyear movie, hit that like. Curve down, or if you like Toy Story, hit that like button and then click the uh, subscribe. Just to, I'm gonna post a lot more stuff like this. Okay. All right, over here, down. So I'm gonna take this plate, and I'm gonna find the insignia in the center. And we're gonna shorthand it right there, putting in these shapes, maybe something in the middle, and then put line, line, because there's definitely wings in there for that Star Command logo. <coughs> Straight line down. Maybe move it up a little bit. And curve up. And here, down. Over here, right on. I'm gonna go over here now, and I'm gonna draw the button right here. He has on his plate. Draw a line, line. It's like a slanted uh, square like that. And then inside, I'm gonna draw. It's looks gonna look like three pills or something. It's those buttons, I guess. And on the other side. A rectangle up here and a circle right here for kind of that button that he has right there. Down, curve in for part of the joint of the shoulder. Curve right here and down. Curve underneath like so. Line over here, down. Alright, so now let's go over here and draw the, you know, he has the 
circular part of his helmet there. So we're gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to make it up here. I'm literally gonna try to make it about here. So curve right there. And I'm gonna have the cat sitting over here, so we're not gonna really be able to make that work yet. Let me see. And then down here. If you want, you can throw another square over here, maybe another square over here. And maybe that curve on the back of his spacesuit that you can see inside there. To kind of give it a some dimension, right? Because that's kind of what you're after. You kind of some after uh, you know some some kind of curves in there. Now let's draw socks. Right on. So socks is going to be we're gonna draw his foot first. Curve underneath up. Curve up, down right here for his hind leg, right there the hind leg. Curve over here, his hind leg on that side, and that's that one he's not going to really show that much. That's his front leg by the way. Line here, line up. <clears throat> curve over here for his neck right there his uh, collar line down circle with his uh, name tag <clears throat> gonna go over here curve that up line over here Out, down, out, down. All right. Now let's go, well, actually we can do uh, this same exact shape on the inside. Like so. And we can go and draw his humongous eyes. He has really big eyes, so we're gonna circle on this side. And circle on that side. And right here, smaller circle in the middle. It's gonna be for his mouth. We're gonna give him a tiny triangular nose, curve, curve. Okay. Another gigantic circle inside here, another gigantic circle inside here. Right on. All right, and if you want to keep learning how to draw and keep pushing your skills, go right here to this video on here on this side. Um, that video I put because it's the exact same theme as the video you just saw, and it kind of I like it as a bit of a pair. So absolutely go check that out right now. Another short video.